Health professionals in northeastern Japan are suspicious about a trend they're seeing after the nuclear accident there two years ago. The normal incidence rate of thyroid cancer in children is one in hundreds of thousands. But 18 children in Fukushima Prefecture have been diagnosed among a population of about 2 million. A panel is examining the impact of radiation on residents. Health professionals are giving checkups to all 360,000 children aged 18 or younger at the time of the accident at Fukushima Daiichi. Radioactive substances released in the accident can accumulate in children's thyroid glands, possibly increasing their risk of developing cancer. Health professionals had tested 210,000 children by the end of July. On top of the 18 minors they diagnosed, they suspect 25 others may have the illness. Members of the panel say they can't determine if the accident has affected the rate of cancer among children. They've decided to set up a team of experts to look into the situation. Agriculture officials are out to prove Japanese cuisine is healthy. They're looking to sell more produce and food items abroad. And they plan to ask the government for more than $10 million to do it. The officials want scientists to confirm that eating the national fare can help prevent obesity. They're thinking of conducting experiments with people on a Japanese diet. They say they'll also work with universities and hospitals to monitor elderly people who usually eat Japanese food. They want to identify new items that offer health benefits. The officials say they'd use the findings to encourage people abroad to eat more Japanese fare. They hope the push will yield big results as the cuisine is already popular with health-conscious consumers around the world.